Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is the Big K Cup 360 here, and Sledgehammer Games have come out with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare on the PC. I have bought the PC version. I've tried it out, and guys, look, let me tell you right now. Thank God. Let us praise Sledgehammer. They have looked at many of the issues that came with Ghosts, and man, they have just like fixed like all of them. Now, firstly, let, let's just get into the good stuff. Now, as a whole, Advanced Warfare has gotten quite you know pretty good reviews like it's got a meta score metacritic score of 84 to 85 ish around there depending on your platform which is very very good much higher than fucking call of duty ghosts like 75 or like 77 or something like that because that game was absolute trash um i've you know i haven't been afraid to say that multiple times but moving on uh this game runs much better than Ghosts does. Ghosts was like Micro Stutter City. It was just trash. Like you had frame rate drops and all this other BS. But this game it runs super smooth. Um, it, it looks good. It looks much better than Ghosts as well. It truly is a next generation Call of Duty game. If, uh, Sledgehammer really... Uh, they up the ante here. We've got you know better textures, you know, better lighting, better shadows and whatnot. The game itself just it really does look very good. Now of course it's not gonna look like Crisis. It's not gonna look like it's, I wouldn't even say it looks like Battlefield, but it it's a very very big improvement. Like the game it does look gorgeous. Um and just overall this is like a slight you know little quick overview of the game, but overall the game is just more fun. Like. The entire dynamics of, you know, boost jumping, you know, double jumping, you know, dodging and shit, it makes the game overall more fun. COD Ghosts was such an average game. It was just so bland. It's like Infinity War didn't give a shit about it. It was so bland, it was so boring. It was such a cookie cutter COD game. It was just bad, but this game, it's like Sledgehammer really wanted to do something new, make something new for the Call of Duty franchise, bring something fresh to the series, and they've done exactly that with this series, exactly that. I'm very, very proud of Sledgehammer Games, and especially in terms of their PC ports, there are so many video options for a Call of Duty game that are up for, you know, change in this game. It's amazing. Like, there's, there's just so many different video settings and options you can change. It, it's really good. Now, of course, it's not, you know, like, top of the line, you know, like, 50 settings to change. It's around, I believe it's 24, but... You know, it's very good. You can make lots of minor adjustments to make it suit your rig, your lifestyle, your playstyle. And just, uh, it's it really is. It's It was a breath of fresh air to see something good like this. Especially for a COD game on PC. Because a lot of PC gamers hated fucking COD Ghosts because of all the PC problems. But look, let's, not, let's be honest. It's not just PC gamers that hated COD Ghosts. Lots of people hated COD Ghosts. The game was absolute trash. So... Continuing on, um, I will get into the campaign, but I expect this game to have a better campaign or one of the best campaigns for COD in probably a very long time because the campaign actually looks legit, it looks really good. Kevin Spacey, you know, this whole private military corporations kind of shit, it looks really, really good. It looks very promising and I can't wait to get into it. This is probably going to be like the first campaign game or first campaign COD that I've actually played since, ooh, what was the last campaign I played? Black Ops 1? No, yeah, Black Ops 1 was the last campaign for a COD that I actually played. Um, did Black Ops... Yeah, Black Ops 1. Because after Black Ops 1 came MW3, that game was shit. Yeah, Black Ops 1 was the last uh, campaign I played. So hopefully this... Hopefully this shit is some... It's some good shit. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And stay tuned for some more Call of Duty gameplay. Because in case you guys didn't know, my channel started off pretty much as a COD channel. And you know... If this game is good, then I'm going to bring a bit of COD back. I'm going to mix this up with some face cam stuff. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you later.